Hello, uh, Jim Howard here in Fort Worth, Texas. Today's date, it is March 3rd of 2017. I went to the doctor on the 1st. By the way, I'm going to call this, I'm going to set up a uh, playlist. I'm going to call it 10 with Jim. Echo, set an alarm for 10 minutes. 10 minutes, starting now. Okay. So I'm going to try to hold these to 10 minutes. That can be difficult for me. It'll be a, a interesting, uh, not interesting content, but interesting <laughs> if I can pull this off. Uh, went to the doctor on Monday, and the doctor did a biopsy of the place on top of my head and the place on my shoulder. Uh, took the place on my shoulder off. He didn't do a biopsy. That just took that growth off, did a biopsy that he's 95% sure from looking at it that it's cancer. Uh, I'll have the results back in four to five days. The doctor was sniffling and everything when I was there and I asked him if he had a, uh, if he had a cold. He said no, that he did not. Uh, I now have a cold. I went to the doctor on the 1st. And today's the third. I have a cold. So I did a search, Google search. How long does it take to get a cold from someone? And it takes two to three days once you've been uh, confronted the virus. So uh, I don't, I don't normally take things, but my nose has been running. That well, my throat. I've been sneezing some. My throat hurts. I have a little bit of a fever, but my nose is running constantly. I can't find that skill. To find skills, go to the skills section of the Alexa app. Uh, so I looked up and it takes two to three days. So, and you, I think you probably know me. If, if you watch, if you're a regular, I don't get out very much. This is about it. My bed's there. My computer is here, my chair is here, and the kitchen is down that way, and that's about it. So the doctor gave me a cold. Uh, my daughter, who is here for a while to help us move, got me a Yeti uh, thing for holding liquids. Really nice. I she I just she got it. It came in today, and she washed it and. I've got it, and it keeps beverages cool or hot for a long time. So what I'm trying to do is, you, maybe you also know if you watch, you know, I don't drink water. I get my water from the ice and my Coke. So I put water in this, and I'm going to try and, and excuse me, try to drink, try to drink water. Oh, what I wanted to say too, uh, that's what I, was, I started to talk about. I really never was one to take. Well, when hay fever kicked up in Kansas City, Missouri, I did take stuff for the hay fever to, uh, but I'm not one to take uh, stuff for colds and that type of stuff. But uh, my nose has been running so much today. I looked around at what, what we had here and it, you're not supposed to take it if you have a heart uh, disease or if you have uh, enlarged prostate and prostate difficulties and a couple, anyway, it's I counterindicated I should not take it. I didn't know Hillary has been, <clears throat> then she looked up and uh, she couldn't find anything <laughs> that for coals that somebody with the condition that I have uh, really should take. I know I'm sure a lot of you go ahead and take you know, maybe a lot of you have the same problem I do, and you, you go ahead and uh, take it, take stuff. So, uh, what's been going on? Um, the, Hillary's here to help with the moving. She'll be here a few days, and she discovered the first cat that she had uh, neutered, fixed over here. Uh, lovable big old cat, male cat. It, it's got some problems. It was gone. It was missing until she she went out and found it in the neighborhood, 
and uh, so she's arranged to going to take it to the vet on Monday and have its problems checked out. Uh, what else is going on? Um, that might be it. And the buzzer hasn't sounded for 10 minutes. Uh, moving stuff around here in the room, trying to find a place to put everything. Uh, one problem we have when my ex-wife moves over here, she's in a wheelchair and she can't get a wheelchair into the bathroom, not over there or not over here. So she'll have, she has to get down out of the wheelchair and scoot and the doorway leading into the bathroom here has some nails or screws sticking up. So we asked the office here, they're going to have uh, the maintenance come over and do something. Hillary tried uh, putting down a pad and different things over there and it, it would, it would move. So, uh, uh, Hillary ordered in pizza tonight for us here and next door. We had a hamburger pizza with onion. It was good. I ate three pieces. That's more than I usually eat, but I ate three. So I'm getting ready to have a salad. So this would be a good time to uh, bring this to a conclusion. Well, I wanted to, but there won't be time, I don't think. wanted to, maybe in each one of these videos, do a fast take on the politics. But I don't think that I'm going to have time this time. I think I've uh, brought up too much stuff. So in these 10-minute videos, I'm going to try to real quick just do political stuff very fast. No rambling like 40 minutes or an hour and a half like I'd, I've done. And then throw in what you've seen. So uh, thank you very much for watching.